Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, my name is Brittany. And um, today I just wanted to uh, do kind of like a little get to know me video real quick for um, any of my new subscribers or future viewers. Um, basically, you don't really know anything about me. <laughs> So I wanted to just um, kind of let you know um, a little about who I am and um, since it's October, I thought why not do 31 facts about me for the 31 days of October because it's one of my favorite months and that's not on there. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm just going to jump right in. Uh, number one. I am 28 years old and I was born March 11th so anybody else out there you know same birthday let me know or so March baby uh, I'm a Pisces so uh, we're really emotional um, and I have my list right here so you're gonna see me looking down like quite a bit so bear with me um, okay fact number two I am the only child, or I am an only child, still today. Um, okay, fact number three, I hated school. <laughs> I'm just going to put that out there. Um, I'd rather be do, I would rather have been doing anything other than going to school every day. It was just boring to me. I wasn't in, interested in it and um, call me lazy, but I just never enjoyed school. So, um, anyway, fact number four, speaking of school, um, for my senior year, I did a homeschool program where they just sent me my home homework for the week and um, I would just do it and then send it back. And at the end of the year, I got to graduate, like an actual graduation, so that was pretty cool. But I did not graduate with my um, my actual high school <laughs> senior class or uh, people that I basically grew up with. And I'm actually alright with that. Uh, fact number five, I met my husband when I was 16. I was about to be 17. Um, and he is three years older than I am. So I'm not going to get into how we met. <laughs> That'll be for another time. Fact number six. Um, I, as soon as I graduated, um, after the summer, I started cosmetology school. Um, at the time, that's what I thought I wanted to do. And so I, I went for a couple of months and my husband and I had already been together for, and living together for quite a while. Um, a couple of years, I guess, and um, I, we found out I, <laughs> we found out we were pregnant. <laughs> it was like January, I think we found out in February. No, we found out in February, um, and I had started cosmetology school in September, so not very far in did we find out I was pregnant and so I was also only well we'll get we'll get to that fact because I haven't wrote down sorry I'm getting way ahead of myself okay so fact number seven about me I am addicted to sushi I love sushi oh my gosh I could eat it every day I love it so much that I have learned how to make it myself because um, in our town, there's nowhere to actually go and get real Japanese sushi, like our Chinese buffets have their version, but I would have to go like almost 45 minutes away to a bigger town to get actual Japanese sushi. So I've just learned that if I'm getting like a craving and I just have to have it and I can't go that far or pay that kind of money, 
I learned how to make it myself, and I'm not gonna lie, I make it a lot and I eat it a lot. <laughs> uh, fact number eight, I don't like organizing. So, I don't know why. <laughs> I like cleaning, but I cannot stand organizing, and you'll see that in any of my cleaning videos or when I decide to organize something because I gotta get my act together with that. Hopefully one day I'll like it, but right now I hate organizing. <laughs> What's wrong? What happened? Hey, what happened? You hit your head. How'd you do that? How did you hit your head? Alright, fact number nine. Um, I used to not like cleaning. In fact, the first couple of years, me and my husband, or, well, we were only dating at the time, we got our first place together, and I'm not even gonna lie, he did pretty much all the cleaning and all of the laundry. Because, like I said, I was the only child, and my mother was a godsend, an amazing mother, she still is. She never made me do anything, and so I never did anything. <laughs> but now I love cleaning. Um, it's it's grown on me. So, uh, fact number ten. I used to not want kids, like ever. Like I just never saw myself being a mom. It never really came naturally to me so yeah until until I met Zach um, and we kind of started getting serious the thought grew on me but I I wanted to wait like I, I never really thought about it happening anytime soon if it happened it happened but I was in no rush whatsoever Neither one of us were in any rush, so, yeah, but guess what? We have two kids now, and, um, I wouldn't change a single thing about it. I absolutely love them to death, and my life would not be where it is if I did not have them in there. So, um, fact number 11, um, October 15th of 2017, so last October, yeah, my anniversary's coming up on this, um, I had a really bad car wreck. Um, I broke both, and I was alone, by the way, and I didn't hit anybody, I just damaged some trees and myself, so, um, but I broke both of my legs and broke... Um, I broke my shin, is it shin, tibia bone, or femur bone, I don't know, I, um, but I broke that in half, and then I shattered my, and that was on my left leg, and on my right, I shattered my ankle, and some bones, and everything, and my foot, and so for five months, I was in a wheelchair, um, and I'm still to this day, like, the reason I, it'll probably be a while until I do, like, an entire, um, cleaning video, like, of my entire house, and if I do do it, it's gonna be in, like, not in the same day, because I'm still having a hard time really getting a whole lot done in a short amount of time because of that, so... Um, number 12, I debated on sharing this one because this is so bad. I have a spending problem. <laughs> there, there it is. I'm just going to say it. I have a really bad spending problem and I have been working on it for years and I think I'm getting, no, I'm not getting any better, but I have faith that one day, uh, it, It'll get better. I'm gonna keep working on it. Uh, fact number 13. I have never been to Disney World. 
and I'm really sad about it. Um, maybe one year, the girls may be almost 20 when we go, and I may be way too, like, old to do anything. I doubt it. But it is definitely something, it's a goal. It's a future goal. Um, and fact number 14, my dream vacation would be, um, to go to Japan. Like I said, I, not only do I love sushi and I love Japanese food in general, I just love everything about Japan. Um, I just, I think it would be awesome to go there. I'm just interested in the history and their culture and everything about it. So that would be my dream vacation if it ever happened. Um, <clears throat> number 15, I would much rather watch reality shows than like series shows. Um, I don't know why. I guess I just like watching other people's drama. It's entertaining. <laughs> Which, and I love watching YouTube, so. And YouTube's not drama like reality shows, but still. Um, I just rather watch that than try to like get into a series. Uh, fact number 16, I'm a homebody. Um, and this is on fact 25, so we'll get there, but I, I've read, I'd much rather be at home than out in public. Um, that's just, just me. Fact number 17, my least favorite chore is putting up laundry. I have no problem putting it in the washer. I have no problem putting it in the dryer. I don't even have a problem putting it in the laundry basket or folding and hanging it up. I just, or putting it on a hanger. I just don't like actually putting it up. And so <laughs> anywhere that I fold laundry or anything, it just piles up. Like eventually I will put it away, but <laughs> it could be there for a couple of days. I'm just keeping it real with you on that one. That is my least favorite chore. Um, <clears throat> number 18, I got pregnant with my first daughter, Abby, at age 19. I was, uh, two months away from being 20. And fact number 19, I got married at 21 to my, I guess you could call high school sweetheart. I was still in high school. He wasn't, but... Um, that's just how I'm gonna put that one. Um, <clears throat> sorry, my throat is so dry. Fact number 20, I have always been a stay-at-home mom. Like I said, um, I did go to cosmetology school. I got my license, and I keep my license up every year, but I have never worked in a salon, and I have really never worked at all. I've always been a stay-at-home mom. That's what I love doing. And, um, I hope I get to enjoy doing that, even when both of the girls are in school. Maybe, maybe I'll have, by that time, another little one to take care of and have an excuse to keep staying at home. <laughs> but, that's a whole nother ball game. Um, fact number 21, I started, let's see, Adeline was... Adeline was born in 2013, and she was maybe six months old. I started doing photography, um, and I still do it today. It's just kind of like a side hobby, side income, but I really love doing it. Fact number 22, um, about, it's been about three years ago, I started doing, um, baking cakes and designing them and selling them. Um, I have no idea because I used to hate baking, <laughs> but somehow it just started kind of becoming therapeutic and relaxing and I enjoy the artistic side of it. So I started kind of doing that too. So I have photography, I have that and, um, I clean a couple of people's houses. Uh, just whenever they need it. 
So, I'm like a jack of all trades. <laughs> Number 23, I am a cat lover. Oh my gosh, I can't even stress that enough. We didn't have dogs growing up. Um, we always had cats or bunnies, but I can't, I can't deal with a bunny right now. So we try to have a bunny for a little while and I just, I, I couldn't do it. So, but I am a cat lover and I got our cat Chester, who you'll see in like all of the videos except this one because he's asleep in the living room on our couch, like always. Um, we got him, he's like almost 10 years old. I don't know how old he was when we got him, but he is my baby. Like, he's my fur baby. I just, <laughs> I love him so much, and I do. I treat him like a baby. Um, I spoil him to death. Fact number 24, I am a girly girl, but I'm also kind of a tomboy. Um, kind of. I don't mind, I'm, I'm from the south, and I have no problem going mud riding, or I don't hunt, sorry. Sorry for anybody who hunts out there, I don't hunt. Um, my husband duck hunts though, and he's always tried to get me to come, and I never have, and I probably never will. So, but I, I love makeup, I love hair, I love fashion, but I would much rather be in uh, yoga pants and a comfortable shirt, <laughs> comfortable t-shirt, or if it ever cools down, I can't wait to wear my sweaters. Ugh, I'm so ready for that. Fact number 25, I have anxiety and depression. Depression's not so bad, it comes and goes. Anxiety, I have battled it for my entire life, which is why I am a homebody. I, um, I do take medication. And I try, I've been trying to get into like um, meditation. It hasn't really done anything yet, but maybe if I keep trying it, it will. But I have really bad social anxiety. And after my wreck, I had really bad, um, I guess, uh, PTSD or uh, post traumatic anxiety. I don't know what the terms are. But I hate being around a whole lot of people. Um, fact number 26. When I was 18, I was diagnosed with interstitial, and I'm probably not saying it right, uh, cetitis. It's a, uh, it's a bladder disease, I guess. And it's pinpoint bleeding all over my bladder. It causes me to have to go to the bathroom a lot. I know where every single bathroom is, everywhere I go, and um, it can cause kind of like crampy pain that just comes and goes, and um, there's no cure for it except for medication. Hopefully when, sometime in the future there will, there will be, but right now there's not. Okay, Adeline's joining us. I guess her boo-boo's better. And she wants to be in it so but we're almost done uh, fact number 27 I love junk food there I said it um, I've been trying really hard to eat better but I still I still love my junk food um, fact number 28 my favorite genres of music is classic rock I know that's hard to believe and 90s Rock. I love 90s rock. Do that. Did that say that? Okay, fact number 29. Um, I have terrible acne, um, and I'm really self-conscious about it. Fact number 30. Um, my favorite movie of all time is Twister. Is I hate it. This isn't facts about you. <laughs> Lay back down. I, I uh, my favorite movie is Twister. Even... I absolutely just, I can't tell you how many times I've seen that movie. Oh. Probably a million. Um, oh, like a million seen. And my favorite time to watch it is on like really stormy days or when we have tornado warnings. Like that's, 
a fun, weird fact about me. I don't, I don't know. Um, and last but, last but not least, um, 31 and the last one. Um, when I was little and to this very day, I wanted to be a storm chaser. I guess that goes along with my fascination with Twister. Um, I wanted to chase storms, especially tornadoes. Um, I've just always been fascinated in the weather and storm systems. Um, but I could never be a meteorologist because, yeah, I don't, I don't think I would do a very good job at that. Adeline. What? I'm trying to wrap this up. Sorry, I'm trying to make it be more funnier. Yeah, yeah you make everything and funny. No. Anyway, so, um, yeah, those are just like 31 fun, fun, random, somewhat informational facts about me. And, <laughs> Adeline, you're so distracting. Stop. I'm just going to forget you're there. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video and got to know a little bit about me and obviously you're getting to know a lot about her Ooh. she's a mess she's so crazy um, anyway so um, if you like this video and um, never describe <laughs> it's not describe Adeline it's subscribe <laughs> Sorry. anyway um, please give it a thumbs up and if you have and um, if you haven't already subscribed I would love to have you join our channel to hit the notification bell so you're notified on any of my oh goodness Adeline you're such a baby um, so here um, so don't forget to hit the notification bell if you would like to stay updated whenever I uh, post a new video <laughs> and anyway so we're gonna go now because clearly I'm never going bye. I'm just gonna keep talking bye. over her bye. so anyway hope y'all have a good day bye